So this game has a development console. You can do all sorts of neat things like show me all the levels or I can move to a level. I can also do things like evaluate expressions, call inbuilt GDScript functions. You can even pass those as arguments to existing functions. Now I've moved to a random level. So how does all this work? Do I parse a million strings or use regexes or something? No, this is using GDScript expressions. So it's a special type built into Godot. Basically what it does is just let you run little snippets of GDScript at runtime. So here's the console node. First, we have a canvas layer, so it appears of everything. And then we just have two text edits. This is my input text edit. And then here I print all the output of the expressions. And I set this to read only. And how it does all the colors and stuff, that's just text edit being magic. And this is the entirety of the code. It's just getting the text from the input here. It's saying, create a new expression, parse the expression. Is it valid GD script or not? And then the magic is execute the expression on self. Now I can execute any function in this node. So here is my print levels. It's just pulling out an internal object from my own game. I'm printing it, just an array. And then move to levels, same thing. Move to levels is an existing function in my game. I'm just exposing it and calling it here. And then to show you that it really is easy, let's add a new function called echo. And echo will take in a value, and then it's going to return the value. Echo sound. There we go, it works. Nothing to it. Yeah, so that's expressions. Um, they're really, really useful for writing dev consoles, things like that. Uh, but two notes is that you cannot execute all GD script, like you can't create new variables. Um, other limitations like that exist, so just be aware. And the second thing is that sometimes people might tell you, oh, you know, I heard expressions aren't safe, so I wrote my own language where I parsed a bunch of strings. It's like, look, if you did that, that's cool, man. But uh, I saved myself a bunch of time and didn't do that. Um, and if you're worried about safety, look, GD script is an interpreter language, so it would always have been very easy to just inject arbitrary code into the game and run it, you know? Don't worry about that until you are whatever lead developer for netcode on Grand Theft Auto 6 or something like that. Um, until then, I'd say, you know, expressions are just fine. Um, yeah, and as always, if you want to support me, you can wishlist my game Space Bandit. Here's a map editor. And expressions. <laughs> okay, thanks.